Hello everyone, welcome to Capture One in One Minute, where we explore one feature of Capture One to make your workflow better and easier. We're continuing a series on the most important tool available to you in working with contrast, and that is the Curves tool. We've explored how to use the preset automated uh, aspects of Curves, which is the three little lines. But what if you have a particular way that you like to build in a curve for contrast adjustment and you use it regularly, uh, you can build this. So what I'm gonna do is create, uh, they give you these little grids, I'm gonna create a dot there, I'm gonna create one there, and I think I'm gonna create one there. And I'm gonna take my shadows down a little bit, I'm gonna bring my brighter area up a little bit, but I'm gonna take shadows a little bit darker than I made bright areas bright. And I might say, hey, I like that, I might use that a lot. All right, I'm gonna come in here and I can save a custom preset, just right there at the bottom. Click on that, it'll give you a little dialog box. And what I can do is just hit save. At that point, it's gonna ask me to save this. And I might say it's Joe's S-curve. Great, so we can click that in. Now what if I come to another image? I can grab this one, click on the three lines, and I can say, please use Joe's S-curve. And now the way that I normally build my particular contrast and curves adjustment is something I can automate for the future. All right, thanks a lot for watching. I'll see you next time.